I've got in my possession a mystery box from one of my favorite companies who do mystery boxes. This is from Zobi Productions. Everybody knows I'm a huge fan of Zobi from their Zobi Fright Pack, their pop culture box. They've got a wrestling box. They even have anime box, uh, gaming box. They have all kinds of different mystery boxes you can purchase. Some are sold monthly, some are bi-monthly. They also do autograph, like pre-orders. They go around the country and meet celebrities. And then you can have your items autographed by the celebrity through Zobi as the middleman. It cuts out, you know, any kind of, you know, sketchy purchases you might get off eBay where you just hope it's authentic. But with Zobi, which I've used for a lot of my autographs, a lot, I know they're 100% authentic every single time because Zobi is a very legitimate company who deals with autographs and memorabilia. So, what we got here is the newest January 2020 Fright Pack. So, fun fact, right now, as of the recording of this video, I'm recording this Friday. What is today? January 3rd at 5.49 p.m. So, as of this second, this box is still available for sale. Will it be available still tomorrow or Sunday or Monday? I don't know. So let me tell you about this Fright Pack from Zobi. Fright Pack, two year anniversary box. So it might be a little bit special. The price point, this is the director's cut box that is $60. The director's cut is a bi-monthly mystery box that includes, that includes horror themed related collectible items centered around authentic celebrity autographs. The director's cut box will feature all five of the movie franchises, includes two autographs. And then there is the standard cut that is only, oh, the standards, oh, I think the standards sold out. I think it's sold out. I think, yeah, it appears the standard sold out. I think the standard was like 40 bucks, but it's gone. It's, it's gone. All that's left is the director's cut which is the higher tier. And so, the movie franchise is available in this box, Night of the Living Dead, Return of the Living Dead, Leprechaun, Carrie and Maximum Overdrive. So how fun are those five franchises in this box? Random boxes will have Easter egg bonus items in them, not guaranteed, but you can possibly get some bonus items out of all these boxes. So you ready to see what's in this bad boy? So for 60 bucks, you know, you're guaranteed two autographs in here for 60 bucks. Oh, I forgot to mention, if you purchase anything off of the Zobi website, make sure you use my promo code that I have. It is KICKS10, that is KICKS10, saves you 10% off of the Zobi website on most items. Like this box, you could have received for $54 instead of 60 save a little bit of money. You can also become a Zobi supporter for a very small monthly fee of like three or four bucks a month where you save 20% off of the website. So you can either become a Zobi supporter, save 20%, or use my promo code, save 10%. Either way you do it, totally fine, save a little bit of money. We all like to save a little bit of money, right? So I don't really want to peek. Here you go. On top, you've got premium white paper for packaging. Here we go. First, it's soft. Is this a t-shirt? First item. We do have a t-shirt. It's been a while since we've had a t-shirt in the Zobi box. A few, maybe a couple months. Okay, nice heavy quality t-shirt. I'll show you the guy, or I'll show you first. Ladies and gentlemen, what does it look like? Okay, that, that's cool. We got the Leprechaun. Yeah, that's really cool. It says, drink me or I'll bite your ear off and I'll make a boot out of it. A direct quote from the Leprechaun. You got Leprechaun here, 100 coins. Whiskey, 120 proof, a 700 years. Leprechaun Distilling Company. Okay, this is actually a cool t-shirt. It's cool. I've never seen a t-shirt like this kind of a graphic before. Yeah, this is the Gildan Ultra Cotton t-shirt. Got your man size 3XL. Your baby gorilla size. So yeah, I like this t-shirt. First item. Cool. So I don't know if you'll also get this t-shirt in the standard box because I can't pull up anymore because it appears it's sold out, but this t-shirt there is worth 20 bucks. That's, that's a pretty cool, cool item. 
Here we go, the monthly pin, I'll show you first. Hopefully it's focusing, I'm not too sure. And we've got Maximum Overdrive. This is limited edition, I have only 500 made, exclusive to the Zobi Fright Pack. So Maximum Overdrive, that's the movie with uh, Emilio Estevez in it. And this is one of the trucks, like the semi-trucks, remember, that came alive and they caused havoc. So yeah, that's cool. I'm sure these pins probably have variations to them. Most of their exclusive pins, they're numbered out of like, you know, like a short print for like 100, then like one out of 500 or so. So I'm sure that there's, or this actually might be the short print, but there's probably some shorter print than that, more, more than likely. Okay, next, here is the art print. I'll show you first. And we have Carrie. Oh, that's a really cool art print. That's actually very lifelike. I know it is an actual print that somebody drew, but yeah, that actually looks really good. Back of this, certificate of authenticity for this art print. It states, certificate of authenticity, limited edition print by Bloody Gorgeous. The owner, photographer is Heather Taylor. Owner FX, Nika Taylor, and model, Brianna Taylor. Okay, so this actually is like an actual, this isn't a, like a pain, this is, this is, this is actually a photograph. <laughs> so disregard what I just said, but yeah, that's really cool. That's actually a really cool print. I like it. It'd be cool to get signed by somebody. Was it signed by the artist or anything? I don't think so. Hmm. I'm having trouble hearing you. I wasn't talking to you, Siri. Sometimes Siri talks to herself. Okay, we have... Oh, we got the thank you note. Every single Zobi box, no matter which one you get, JR, who owns Zobi, always put a little note in here. This box, this box marks the second anniversary for our Zobi Fright Pack. Thank you for all the support and Happy New Year, JR. President of Zobi Productions. So yeah, JR, I've met him a couple times. Really cool guy, uh, really cares about this company and really takes care of his customers. I mean, yeah, support Zobi. Here we go, first autograph item. The back of it, you've got your JSA authentication. Everybody knows I'm like a huge fan of JSA. It's it's the top company in, in the world to authenticate all your autographs. They authenticate in person at autograph signings or you can send stuff into JSA. They will actually authenticate it for you. I've actually done it both ways. I've done it in, in person, and I've actually sent stuff off before the JSA to have them signed. So anyway, first autograph picture, and I'll show you first. Who do we have? Oh, that is from that is from Night of the Living Dead, the original black and white version from. Ooh, what what year was that? Nineteen fifties, forties. This is signed. I hurt by the young girl who gets zombified. I know they remade this in colored version back was in 1991. That's actually my favorite zombie movie of all time is the remake of The Night of the Living Dead. Uh, featuring, uh, what was it, Tony Todd was in it. Uh, the other actor, actresses, I don't remember the name, but yeah. The remake of the original Black and White is actually my favorite zombie movie of all time. Cool. Okay, I like it. I don't really have much signed stuff from Night of the Living Dead, so this is actually kind of cool. I'm actually, if you know this about me, I'm a huge zom zombie genre movie fan. Zombie books, zombie comics, zombie stuff. I love the zombie genre. I always have my whole life since I was a small kid. I've always loved the zombie genre. So I'm very happy that it's, that you know, it got popular about 15 years ago and like it stayed kind of popular, so that's awesome. Oh, so, yeah. Huge fan of the zombie genre. My wife is not. <laughs> so here we go. Next. Oh, we have a card. Um, is there a promo code on here? No. Okay, but it says ten dollars off with your next purchase. Your or ten dollars off your next purchase with JSA. Awesome. Then the back says James Spence Authentication and Shop Zobi. James Spence Authentication is JSA. So I'm guessing the next time I purchase or I send an item in to be autographed. For JSA, I'd send this card in. Or I bet you also probably the next convention I'm at that JSA is that I can show them this and they'll take $10 off of my order, I bet. That's actually probably use it for because I go to cons uh, during like convention season and yeah, I'll probably just give this to the JSA booth and say, give me $10 off. So yeah, cool. I'll hold on to that. 
but don't lose that. So I think this is the last item peeking. Yep. So I do not see any Zobi Easter eggs. Oh, there's the cheat sheet. So this box did not have any bonus items, no Easter egg, but that's fine. I actually had one last month for one of my boxes. So you can't get them every single time, but whenever you do, it's nice. But this next picture is 11 by 14 picture with the JSA authentication. It's a little card you can slide in and slide out on the back of it. I'll show you first. Who do we have? Oh, nice. Return of the Living Dead. Fantastic franchise. Oh, it's signed by Tarman. Uh, in Return of the Living Dead, the guy who played Tarman. Looks like his name is Alan. Very nice handwriting, but I can't. It's so fancy, I can't. It looks like Alan Frontman, maybe? Okay, this picture would be very cool to get signed by the entire cast. I know that the cast of Return of the Living Dead, they do lots of conventions. So this actually would not be very hard to get signed by the rest of this cast. And even some of the people who aren't on this, but are in the movie. Actually, I'll, that's what I'll probably end up doing this. Pictures get this signed by a lot of these actors from this movie. So I like it. That's awesome. That's awesome. So I have 60 bucks. Let's see the cheat sheet. Let's see what was possible altogether. Oh, we got a double-sided cheat sheet. So we got the Zobi pin. We have a variation out of 500, 100, and 100. And I got the version that was out of 500. Then, of course, you got the T-shirt, the 1993 Inspiration. You have seven carry art prints that were possible, that were made. Then, okay, here's some of the, of the Easter eggs. You could have received a limited to 50 exclusive Return of the Living Dead metal, kind of like a baseball card. I've actually gotten a few of those now. They're actually really, really cool. Or you could have gotten an extra pin for the Leprechaun, if you're lucky enough to get a bonus item. And then the other side... Looks like you had a possibility of one, two, three, five different Return of the Living Dead pictures. I'm actually happy I got this one because I can get the rest of the cast to sign this picture. That will look fantastic whenever I get that completely signed. The other four only have Tarman on it, but the one I have has like half of the cast, so I kind of like that. Then it says, you by 14 photo was hand signed by either Tarman and Return of the Living Dead 85, Alan Trotman, or Bill Robinson and Maximum Overdrive, 1986. So, oh, by Emilio Estevez. Wow. So looks like a few people lucked out and got a Maximum Overdrive picture actually autographed by Emilio Estevez. How cool would that have been? But I actually already have his autograph. Zoe did a private signing with Emilio in 2019, and I actually sent in a Funko Pop of him in Breakfast Club to be signed. This box is freaking awesome. And as of right now, recording this box is still available. I don't know by the time that you actually watch this video if it'll still be up or not. But if it isn't, don't worry. Zobi sells different themed mystery boxes every single month. So if you miss this one, don't worry. You're, you'll have a shot at the pop culture box or the wrestling box, an anime box, or the next Zobi Fright Pack. You know, there's many boxes that you can buy. So just because you miss one, don't worry. There's a lot more boxes coming with awesome content just like this. So thanks for watching this. And uh, yeah, freaking awesome box. I'll see you next time. I'm out.